It's me, Lua, and today I'm actually going to do a different kind of video. I actually am going to do the 50 random facts tags about me. So if you're interested in kind of learning more about me, stay tuned and keep on watching. So starting with number one, um, my name is Lua. I am five foot one, so I'm kind of petite. I'm on the petite side. I do have a middle name, and it's Julia. A lot of people don't know that about me, so my name is Lua Julia. I was born in Hollywood, California, which is the, I guess, I guess like the coolest place ever because that's where like all the tourists go. I am 23 years young, and I know that I probably look a lot much younger, and I think that it's because of my braces, which is kind of deceiving. Uh, my hair is naturally straight, and right now it's actually curled, but it's kind of like falling apart because my hair is so naturally used to being straight. Do you guys see my cat there? <laughs> I have a scar underneath my lip tucked away. I don't know if you guys could see that, but um, I actually got it from going to one of my first concerts, which was Warped Tour in Anaheim, and I was watching The Offspring, and I got shoved into the mosh pit, and... I got beat up pretty bad and I was so scared to like go home because I didn't tell my mom that I was there but luckily it's it's kind of concealed pretty well so mom if you're watching sorry I one of my favorite things to do is actually to travel whether it's local or maybe you know a state over I just really like it because I you, not only do you learn, you know, customs and cultures, but you also learn perspective, learn new perspective on different things. It may be a little strange to some, but I am actually pretty superstitious. Um, I don't know why, I just, I'm intrigued by those like old like, oh, don't cut your nails or your hair at night or something will happen or breaking a mirror. I don't know, I'm just superstitious and I think it's kind of fun. It's like a fun thing to kind of carry on. My first word was Littlefoot. And for those of you who know or watch The Land Before Time, that is actually um, one of the little dinosaurs' name. His name is Littlefoot. And technically speaking, that's two words. So, pat on the back. I actually have a fear of like porous things. Like, um, it could be anything from like that serenum toad who carries like the eggs in its back that like Ugh, like irks me or um, those lotus seed pods or honeycombs even the number eight sometimes no I just I don't like it they just irk me out I just I don't know one of my many peeves in life is when guys wear jeans and flip-flops together and I really don't like it when people don't have common mannerisms like please thank you um, excuse me, those are just kind of, I would think they're common sense almost, but I guess some people just, I don't know, they don't have mannerisms. Um, when I was younger, I actually really liked the appearance of braces, and flash forward to like seven years later, and I have them, and I really don't like them at all. I would have to say that I am one of the worst texters ever. Um, I'm almost technologically handicapped. Another fun fact about me is that I cannot whistle. I don't know if it has to do with braces, but even before I had braces, I just, I, I couldn't whistle. A lot of people tell me that I look aloof, but I like to think that I'm a naturally friendly person. Um, this is kind of silly, but if you ever, like, come to my room and the door is closed and then when you walk out, you leave it open, just know that that is... I don't know, that's me getting up, and I have to, like, okay, get up and close it. Okay, let me just rephrase that, because that sounds crazy. If you ever come into my room for something, and you leave my door open, okay, are you following me? And upon exiting, you don't close the door, and I have to physically, like, walk over and get up and close it, just know that that is me closing the door in our friendship. My first job was actually at Jack in the Box. Pretty glamorous, right? I will forever love you if you not only feed me, but if you scratch my back until I fall asleep. I am not ticklish, and I actually hate being tickled. Like, I just, it gives me anxiety. When I am older, I want to have as many kids as I could possibly afford. 
Another fun fact about me is that I actually really dislike Christmas. I I don't like it. I've never liked it. I don't know what it is. I just I've never really gotten into like the mood or like the Christmas spirit. I just it's just another day for me. One of my many things on my bucket list is to actually cage dive with sharks. Like how sick would that be? Another fact about me is that I love owls. So much so that I actually want to get one, but they're illegal in California. My favorite number is not the number three. A lot of people don't know this about me, but I actually pray a lot throughout the day. One of my favorite foods to eat, whether it be spaghetti, ramen, or chow mein, I just, I love noodles. They're so like filling and they're so yummy. I just, I love noodles. Another interesting fact is that it is bad news if you ever catch me hungry. I would, one time I broke up with a boyfriend because I was so hungry. Of course we made up later, but it is bad news. That's how severe it gets. On my downtime, I actually like to sit back, relax, and play Tetris. In my 23 years of living, I don't think I've ever made out a check to anyone. I don't know if that's good or bad. When I was younger, I actually secretly admired my brother's Adam's apples, and I always secretly wanted one. And it wasn't until I was about like 10 or 11 that I realized that only dudes had them, and then I was like, I don't want one anymore. I am actually ridiculously terrible at giving and taking directions. Chances are I will get you lost and get myself lost in the process. So, yeah, I need a little, like, tom-tom. Uh, one of my favorite vegetables is broccoli, but I have this weird thing that I cannot eat the stems of the broccoli. I can only eat like the like the little bushes <laughs> or like the heads of the broccoli. I have eaten live octopus before and it was actually surprisingly pretty good. And I remember when I was eating it, it's like a little tentacle suction cup thingy got stuck in my esophagus and I seriously thought I was going to choke, but everything was fine after that. This next fact is kind of grim, but I do believe, sadly, that ignorance is bliss. Uh, I collect a lot of things, and one of them includes, you know, obviously thrift store clothes, buttons, and I also collect owl figurines. I choose Pepsi over cola any day. I don't know, I just, Coca-Cola is too bubbly for me. I can't take it. Is that weird? Although I love, you know, kind of laying out at the beach, um, I have found that the sea actually really scares me. It's so vast and a large portion of it has yet to be discovered and that kind of gives me anxiety. So I prefer smaller bodies of waters like lakes and rivers or streams. I'll even, I'll even go for like a creek. I just don't like big bodies of water. I am actually not an adventurous eater, but I will try anything once. I think that's that's pretty safe, right? Uh, one of my favorite colors um, is gold. My favorite flowers are baby's breath. And those are like those little like white baby flowers. I don't know why they're called baby's breath, but they're actually my favorite. When and if I get married, I want to have a mariachi at my wedding. How sick would that be? That would be so much fun. My favorite Disney movie is The Little Mermaid. And I heard it's actually going to come out in theaters, so I'm definitely going to go with the girls to go watch that. I have been told by many people that I'm pretty elusive, and I would have to agree. I just don't like people keeping tabs on me. It's nothing personal, I swear. My first concert was actually at the, the Henry Fonda Theater, and I think it's in Hollywood, I'm not exactly sure. And it was to see The Distillers. And I went with one of my best friends, her name is Carolina. So if you're watching, hi Carolina! At my 8th grade talent show, I actually belly danced, but I didn't win. I won like third place. I lost to um, this girl that was like performing a skit from Shakespeare, but whatevs. It was fun. I have two older brothers, one named uh, Peter and one named Isaac, and they are super fun and kind of crazy like me. When I was younger, I used to have a lot of different animals. I've kind of just grown up having a ton of animals. Um, at one point, I had rabbits, chickens, a guinea pig, ducks, roosters, 
Um, and we were super close to getting a parrot and a pig, but my mom said no, so. Oh, and I had dogs and cats, which is kind of standard, right? So those have been the 50 facts about me. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video, even though it wasn't really thrift related. Um, so next week, I think I will be doing something thrift related, so stay tuned. And if you're not subscribed already, please click like and subscribe. See ya!